Hello, good morning. Happy Saturday. I set my alarm a little early today because I wanna make sure I have time to wash my hair before Grace wakes up. So it's a little after six. Oh, let's go water the garden, make some coffee, and get the day started. Come on, guys. Garden's looking good. The strawberry plants are starting to flower too. Pretty soon each one of those little center parts of the flower will be a delicious strawberry. By the way, leave your uh, last name suggestions for my garden plants in the comments. I saved some really good suggestions from you guys from the like initial garden setup vlog and the seedlings that I started indoors are like a week or two away from being ready to transfer into the garden and that's what I'm gonna give them all names. So if you want to leave a last name suggestion, comments. Kitchen is low-key a mess and <laughs> need to tidy it up this morning, but I'm gonna save that for after my shower, because uh, not to be a cringy millennial, but first, <laughs> coffee and a shower. I just went to fill up the milk thing and realized we have no milk, so I guess I'm just drinking straight espresso this morning. <laughs> Cheers. Ooh. Well, it's gonna wake me up. All right, I'm showered. I'm gonna do a quick style of my hair and then uh, hopefully I have time to tidy the kitchen before Grace is up. Steven is out of town this weekend for a work conference. So it's just Grace and I um, and today's Earth Day. So I was thinking we could kick the weekend off, go down to the coast, do a beach cleanup, show some love to the planet. And my parents are actually camping down at the beach right now. So um, I think they're gonna meet up with us and we'll be near my grandma's house. So I'm thinking Grace and I will stop by there after too. Oh, I need to make sure that I don't forget to bring the invitation that Grace has for my grandma for her birthday party. I cannot believe I am already planning a two year old birthday party. Absolutely wild, but it's only a little more than a month away. We're keeping the party small. It's just family. And then my two best friends, Kenzie and Skylar and their kids. So because because it's small and it's all people that we see all the time, I'm just hand delivering the invitations. Um, but we haven't been able to give my grandma hers yet. So gotta make sure we do that when we go visit her today. I'll show you guys the invitation when we go out there. It's cute, Grace. Grace picked the theme herself. It's a little mermaid theme. And she also helped me pick the invitations on Zazzle. She was so cute. We, we really spent like 30 minutes going through all the different options and she was going back and forth and back and forth and eventually landed on wanting specifically the mermaid one with the fish. So that's what we got, mermaid invitation with a fish. But yeah, uh, my camera battery is blinking, so I'm just gonna finish doing my hair and then I will check in with you guys later. All right, skincare, hair care, done. I'm dressed, I'm ready. Let's go clean the kitchen. <laughs> All right, I got Grace set with her breakfast. I'm gonna unload the dishwasher. And oh, I should I should bring the seedlings outside so they can get some sun. It's gonna be pretty hot today, so I feel like it's better to do it in the morning before the sun is too strong and my poor little delicate seedlings can't handle it. All right, there they are. Which by the way, if you're wanting to leave some plant name suggestions, the ones we're gonna be naming are the tomato seedlings, bell peppers, hot peppers, and the zucchini that are already in the ground. Yes, love bug, I'm watering the seeds. Get them nice and watered. They need water to help them grow. By the way, uh, this is the, the invitation that Grace picked for her birthday. Oh, you wanna hold it? Okay, there you go. All right, I'm gathering stuff for uh, the beach. Trash bag, sunscreen, invitation for my grandma. I'll bring some gloves, some towels. Grace's water. And then just gonna grab the diaper bag, throw in a couple snacks, change of clothes for Grace, and we're ready to go. Yes, honey. Oh. 
You ready? Let's go. Let's go, let's go. All right, we are back home now, having a great afternoon. Grace wanted to have some screen time, so she's watching a video of the Little Mermaid ride at Disneyland right now. Yeah, is that Ariel? Yeah, she loves watching videos of the Disney rides and parades. See, yes, Under the Sea is next, you're right. Um, but while I have a quick moment of pause here, I figured I would update you guys. Had a great time at the beach, actually found a lot of trash. At first I was like, I don't know, the beach looks pretty clean, maybe we should have gone somewhere else, but once we started poking around in the rocks, we found a lot. So that was great, I'm really glad we went and did that, and it was just a gorgeous day down at the beach. Went to my grandma's house, had some time with her, Grace always has a lot of fun playing with all the little toys and trinkets that she has there. The cuckoo clock was the big hit today. Yeah. Yes, it dan they dance. Um, but yeah, it was great. Uh, also, it was good to touch base with my mom because she's coming with us to Disneyland. And Pap, yeah, and Pappy was at the beach. Pappy. All right, lovey, I'm gonna come watch Little Mermaid with you, okay? The ride, yes, the mermaid ride. Good morning, it is now Monday. We are at Disneyland, we're doing a day with my mom, which I'm so excited about because she doesn't have a pass, so it's a special occasion when she decides to buy a ticket and come. And when I was telling her our plans for this weekend with Steven being gone, I was like, yeah, we're gonna do Disney. She was like, you know what? I think I'd like to get a ticket and come, and I'm so glad you did! Yay. Three Generations Disney Day! Yes! First ride, Peter Pan. Peter Pan. magical morning to say the least. She has met so many characters. There were more characters just like roaming around Fantasyland this morning than I've ever seen. She met like Captain Hook, Peter Pan and Wendy, Geppetto, Merida. Um, we did a bunch of rides too and then we went over to Toontown. Of course met more characters. Yes we did! We went through Mickey's house. Um, we almost did the little Toontown coaster because it turns out Grace is actually tall enough for that now. It's her first time. But she was seeming a little bit nervous. We asked her if she wanted to do it. At first she said yes and then she said no. So we just decided we'll wait for another time when she's like really enthusiastic about it. Um, so we came over here to the 100 Acre Woods. We did the Pooh ride, that's right. We just met Eeyore and now she's gonna meet Pooh. <laughs> 
Look, he's gonna sign your book. Oh, he gave it a kiss. Would you like me to take it? Perfect. Thank you. You wanna give him a hug now? Oh. Thank you so much. Thank you. That looks amazing. Thank you so much. So we came over to DCA now. We're gonna take Grace to the Disney Junior Dance Party in a little bit. Um, and right now, well actually, the it's the Food and Wine Festival, but it ends in literally like two days. And when we came here last month for the creator event, they gave us these sip and savor passes for the Food and Wine Festival and the gift bags, but we didn't actually end up using it because they had like a tasting area set up for us. So I brought this with us today and we have eight little vouchers that we can use for different food items and beverages for the Food and Wine Festival. And they have so many different options. So throughout the day today, we are going to try lots of fun little things. Starting with... Avocado toast with olive tapenade. Ooh. And then a uh, impossible Euro, Euro inspired naan. <laughs> oh, thank you, mom. <laughs> that is delicious. It is. It's so good. is this little Toy Story alien drinking cup that we got. We got this over in Tomorrowland. The head like twists off. You can put whatever in there. We just have water and Grace loves it. This has been making her stay super hydrated and it has a little lanyard so you can wear it around your neck. I tied it so that it was shorter because she really wanted to wear it. But I just think this is so cute and I think this is gonna have to come with us for like every Disney trip because how perfect. Grace is having a little snack. Got the phone charging, we're hydrating. She's feeling all the dance moves from the Disney Junior dance party. We did the dance party. We also did um, Turtle Talk with Crush and hung out in the Animation Academy lobby for a little bit before, which is such like a nice middle of the day kind of great activity. It's air conditioning. You doing the monster hop? She is so into the dance party. Oh my gosh. You dancing? I'm gonna try to get Grace to nap in her stroller in a little bit here. No night night. You don't have to sleep, but I think it'd be good for you to rest for a little bit. Yeah, just rest. Cause that'll give you more stamina through the rest of the day. Uh oh, let's not eat that one. Um, and then my mom and I want to try more of the food and wine festival stuff with that sip and savor pass during her nap. And uh, we're also talking about possibly doing child swap for Soren because special only for the food and wine festival, they switched it back to Soren over California instead of Soren over the world which was the way it was when I was growing up. So it's very nostalgic for me. It was always one of my mom's favorite rides too. So another French try. We'll see about doing that. All right, attempting to get Grace to sleep. She's not asleep yet, but she's chilling in there. Beautiful view of the Big Bear Rock. And right down here on this walkway on the way to Paradise Pier, or I guess Pixar Pier now, are a bunch of the Food and Wine Festival booths. All right, Grace is asleep. We're getting two things from this avocado time booth. We've got the impossible al pastor taco and the impossible nacho mac and cheese. Cheers. <laughs> oh my gosh. I love food and wine festival. This has like a, a pineapple chutney of some sort on top and it gives it such an interesting flavor because the rest of it is spicy, but then that is so sweet. Just like that, every little coupon has been used. All right, we got the goods. So we have the California artisan cheese plate, the petite burrata, I think. I hope I'm saying that right. It looks delicious. We have the beet and cheese flatbread on naan, and for my mom, the grilled top sirloin. My mom's in the bathroom, so I'm waiting for her to dig in, but it looks amazing. Grace is sleeping. Beautiful view. Such a good day. So much fun. I just, I love Disney. Being here with Grace is already just so fun, so special. And having my mom here, like just, just brings it to the next level. Okay, best thing in this entire spread, the I'm still not confident in my pronunciation, burrata. I'm savoring everybody. Mm. Oh my gosh, even the sign just makes me excited. 
That was fantastic. I am so just at peace on that ride. I wish it was the Snorin' Over California version all the time, but very, very glad that I got to experience it again like this. All right, it is, I actually have no idea what time it is. I think like five. Grace just woke up. We are off to do some more Gracie favorite rides. And then I think in, uh, in not too long here, we're gonna head back to Disney to close out the evening. <laughs> A little Starbucks pick-me-up as we head back to Disney for the evening. Cheers. Cheers. Oh, I'm sorry. Did you want to cheers too? Cheers. There you go. Cheers. Oh, monorail. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you so much. Back again. By the way, this phone mount, I get questions about all the time for the stroller. I'll link it in the description. It's like one of my favorite things for Disney because like right now I have the park map pulled up with all the wait times. Are you all done with that? Thank you. You'd like some water? Okay, let me pull over here. There you go, my friend. Um, but also sometimes I'll use it for like playing Pokemon Go or whatever I need to do. Like it's just the best. All done? Thank you, my friend. Anyways, I love it. I'll link it. You'd like to eat your cookie again? There you are, my love. Ah. Anyways, we are off to Buzz. <laughs> gonna drive. Mama. Mama. Oh, you? Okay, you drive. I'll be passenger princess. Look at you! You're doing it! All by yourself. <laughs> One more. Right, we're home and look who else is home. I'm so excited to be home. I'm so excited that you're home. I love you. Grace had the most magical time at Disney. I can't wait to show you all the photos. She was, I know. Oh. She's, I've only, oh, I feel like I've been gone so much past two weeks and like, she's just so different. I don't know. Yeah. It's so magical. I feel like in this stage, like the change is like rapid. Yeah, especially with like the language stuff. Like, she's like you know how many new words? <sighs> very glad to be home. Yes, I'm very happy to have you home. Mm. And, uh, well, this, I just wanted to wait to end the vlog with you. So, mm. that's well, really all I had well. to say. Hello, and goodbye. <laughs> <laughs>